is David from goldstartool.com and uh, this is a real quick video uh, for you guys. Um, I got a couple of emails and phone calls, people wanting to know how they could adjust the, uh, the pressure on the food right here. As you know, uh, and this is, a, by the way, Juki 8700, but this uh, applies to all the industrial single needle sewing machines, uh, high shank. There is a knee lifter here that you could use for lifting the foot. There is also a hand lifter right here that you could lift, okay? It depends which one you are more comfortable using. Now, to adjust the pressure right here, sometimes when you put a fabric in here, you feel it's not going uh, as you want it to go. It's not pulling to go forward. That's because there is not enough pressure on here. So you could make a pressure on this one, make the pressure tighter. Uh, how you do it? This right here. This is a screw. This we call this a washer. You open this counterclockwise. And if you need less pressure, you counterclockwise this, okay? And if you want more pressure, you just keep going keep going, keep going, keep going, and till there's more pressure. Let's say if you wanna do something really heavy, if you wanna do uh, uh, denim, two, three layers of denim, you might want less pressure. But if you wanna do sheer material, mesh, fabric, you need, you need more pressure here, so it will go through and don't move. Now, beside that, it does not depend, all the foot, that we use on these machines are the same height from the bottom here to the shank here. So uh, they're all the same. It does not matter. Uh, rarely you have longer or shorter foot. Now, you could also, if you really wanna get technical, here, that's how you do it. You open this tree. Oops, here we go. Uh, this tree is cool. And I'm gonna tell you why I'm opening this. You don't need to open this. Uh, these are here for a reason. You could open this up um, and adjust what you're gonna adjust inside. But I'm gonna just show you. I'm gonna open up the whole thing inside here and um, show you how it's done. Just, okay. So we open the three screws. And the plugins that are here, there is a reason for it. You could just open the plugins and adjust this screw right here. This screw and this screw. This screw you could open the middle one, okay? Yeah, you have light, enough light. Let me get enough light for you. Good? Okay. Yeah. So there is. You open this one, and then you go ahead and adjust the foot by hand. When you open this one, the foot bar will loosen up, and then you could push it down and adjust it the way you want. If you want it higher, then this need foot bar will come up more when this is loose. Okay, now it's tight because of this screw, the uh, setting screw right here. This will also apply for the needle bar. If you need to do, which you rarely need to do, but in case it's out of um, it's out of timing and you want to time it, this is one of the things that you could do. You open this screw right here, and then you also could adjust the needle bar up, going up and down. So. Three things, number one, you mostly 99% of the time could get away by only adjusting this. And uh, it, it happens that sometimes when you play with them after a while they crack or break, it's not a big deal, it's about a couple of bucks. And then if this doesn't work and you need more pressure or less pressure, you don't need to open what I did here, but I did it just to show you, this is the system. There are two plugs in, you open this plugin, one is for the 
food bar, one is for the needle bar. When you pull it back on, you make sure tighter. it. As you see, it's sealed because there is oil. The oil that pumps from here goes right through this machine and goes through the machine. That's why there is this seal right here. You wanna make sure that when you put it back, you seal it. Um, you could also, if you have very rough material, you could also, as we said many, many times, you could change plate and feed dogs and get a heavier duty one. But uh, that's only for this part right now, for adjusting the uh, foot bar and the needle bar. Uh, thank you for watching. Please visit www.goldstartool.com. Like, share. Have a wonderful day.